52 a cry rose from the ghettos of Yoder. They wanted to move away from the oppression, leaving their homeland behind. On board the ships that sailed to the tip of Africa, and brought to the barbaric land to establish themselves a new promised land. I arose from Cape Colony. They wanted to move away to the England. They were oppressed by the British Empire with wagons and oxen that moved away barefoot, facing mountains, rivers and wilderness to establish themselves in new promises. The way of God made for each other. The politics and religion they were fighting would see through corruption rule the land. Adultery, drinking parties, and strife. They were oppressing all the other nations. One sinking body has lost its wounds. Early in 1900s, a loud cry arose from the inland. The Anglo Boer War was putting them down mm -hmm. as gold and diamonds attacked the empire. In 1910, the Union was established and with the British Empire in the needed to search and hope for a promised land fades away. In 1961, the party said, fair enough, you don't have to move away to another country. Take this land and make it your own. Eventually, I had the promised land, but I pressed the other nation. The promised land to be taken by the fools. May the not seek the way of God. May hold each other good politics and religion. We see through corruption in the room in the dead end. They've gone through drinking parties and sleeping. They are pressing all the nations. A loud cry arose from inside the promised land. The need to give up to serve the slaves, living a new miserable life. There is no place to move out from here. No new promised land inside. But maybe someday, promised land for food. From your wicked way and see the counsel of God. He will heal your land, you will never fade away. He will take you into his promised land. They did not seek the way. Don't you drink in the 